the best Amazon finds to make flying with children, small children, less of a nightmare. Part one, family passport holders. So you're not digging through four different bags and trying to keep everyone's passports together, having them all at the bottom of your bag. I bought this one years ago when we were moving abroad and you can fit up to eight passports in here. Currently, I think we have six different passports. There's only four of us, but we've got like a multi-nationality thing going on here for several of us. Uh, there is a little key clip here for your keys to hang on so you don't lose keys. You've got quick access to all of your keys. You have space over here for credit cards, ID cards, anything. I did have one person comment that they like to keep everything separate in case something gets stolen. And I was like, I'm really glad that works for you. My brain could never. Right on suitcases if you have kids that can walk pretty well but are still under like six or seven. This is going to make getting through very large airports much quicker, make your connections go much smoother. When we had one for my daughter had like a built-in scooter on the back and so she was like scooting her carry-on case through the airports. Everyone who passed us that had small kids went, oh, that is a good idea. Where did you buy that? Because I cannot for the life of me keep track of things. <laughs> A sunglass carrier, you're gonna be able to put the entire family's sunglasses in here. This one holds up to five pairs. There are some that hold up to seven or eight pairs. Again, I will link these in my bio, but they are super useful for keeping everybody's sunglasses together so you're not digging through four different bags trying to find the three-year-old sunglasses. Car seats. There's a very high chance that in many places where you'll be visiting, you're going to need your kids' car seats. And most people don't know this, but if you call the airlines or you look on their website, the vast majority of airlines will let you take kids' car seats, check them for free, which is really nice. And all you need to do is get one of these sort of large bags that's gonna cover it. This is gonna protect it, keep it from getting stained or ripped apart, which is not what you want to happen to car seats. They're so blinking expensive. Noise limiting headphones. Whether you bring your own devices or you're going to just be watching whatever's on the plane, having headphones for little kids that are going to limit the number of decibels that they're able to hear on the headphones, limit the sound, is good for their hearing long term and definitely something to consider because you might fall asleep, you might be doing other things and you aren't gonna be wanting to check every three minutes to see if they've cranked up to the sound to the maximum volume, right? We wanna protect their hearing, they're so cute. They have versions like this that are Bluetooth as well. I don't know if those are better or not. I just went old fashioned because I know how to use the plug-in ones and I figured it'd be easy for the kids to figure out too. There are tons of affordable options that are out there now for this for kids. They're excellent, you can buy them, not too expensive. I recommend not getting very expensive ones if your kids are under eight because they will probably break them. Again, everything is linked on my Amazon storefront. If you're interested, I'll have quite a few recommendations there.